know it's something like oh a thing that's indescribable when you're getting ready for a long trip you can't sleep you're tossing and turning and you just you're so excited it's like a uh you're a kid in a candy store or it's the the night before christmas and you can't wait until the next morning so you can open up your gifts this trip we're heading down to key west florida to take some pictures and just to hang out and fellowship you know going to florida you would think that the sun would be out nice and bright and shiny but this ride as it started was very gloomy very foggy very misty and there wasn't any sun breaking through the clouds for a good little while the weather was nice and crisp very cool and it didn't require uh, us to plug up into our heated gear but we definitely needed to bundle up as the temperatures hovered around 40 to 50 degrees. One of the best parts about the trip is knowing that you're riding with a group of people who have similar interests as yourself. A passion for two wheels and a passion for traveling across the country on those two wheels. It's something about hearing the motors, the roar of the engine, watching people give you thumbs up and take pictures as you pass by and pound the highway. Run into older folks who talk about their older days when they did the same thing that we're doing now. As we rode closer and closer to Florida, we finally started seeing some blue skies flanked by puffy clouds and it definitely was a welcome sight and it definitely warmed up at this point. As I started my bike, I noticed my battery light come on. A big time indicator that either your state or your rectifier is failing. So the quickest dealership was about 40 miles away and it closed at 7 o'clock. So we definitely put the pedal to the metal. And we made it there just in time before the service closed. So check this out. I'm at Space Coast. All the Davidson. Damn battery light came on the bike. Which signifies you usually your stator or your rectifier. One of the two. But I ain't got time. We hour and a half or a little under two hours from our destination. We're going to get it checked out. I prefer black. Are you okay with chrome? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Look, they they trying to give me a bye bye, y'all. I ain't trying. <laughs> oh, they, 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 they showing me some bikes right now. Okay. Ooh, ooh, boy, they gonna kill me. Yeah, we're gonna get it at home. Look at this, man. They, they really got me thinking about this shit. Mm mm mm. Gonna be some shit to little boy. Hey, man, look. He was like, nigga, I was stranded. I was stranded. Let me, uh, look, they didn't, they didn't, I didn't got me a new bike, y'all. There it is over there. Ain't that crazy? Look how they do me. Look how they do me. Mm mm mm. You know, we got the round up, so. Right. It ain't, that ain't, our, that's our time to be. Right. I'm just going pants. Peterson? Yep. Peterson's Harley Davidson gonna get us checked out. Later on that evening, we all got together to head over to Miami Rare Breeze meet and greet. If you know, like I know, it's definitely gonna be a packed fun field event so we took off down the streets of miami cruising through the night taking in the sights and the sounds
Under control. Time is three. No, two fifty five. Yep, I'm gonna head on down to the bottom to the zero. definitely had to make our trip down to Key West in early and the number of people who travel down there daily coupled with the two lanes and with a max speed of 45 miles per hour makes for a long and miserable ride so we wanted to get down there get in and out take our picture hit mile marker zero and get back up to the mainland But see, like I say, like right now, this is the time to kick it up. Ain't nobody here. Like all them, them cars ain't ain't real cars. They they had these dummy cars. Hey man, we made it out here. Uh, yeah, to get it, get uh, get out here early because people will be here ready to take the pit, take a picture with the southernmost buoy, also to watch the sunset over yonder. <laughs> so, right, 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 right. Right. So. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get somebody to take a picture of all of us together. Yeah. Sure. Hey, I can um put my drone in the air and take a picture of all of us. I could. Man, that roost is going crazy over there, boy. Yeah. <laughs> 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 swap and install and 
a little bit of food and then on our way back to the top what's the name of that place Stopping for breakfast and the sun shining down on us, we headed back up to Miami. But it wouldn't be a trip without issues as my stator would go completely out as we hit the turnpike. That motherfucker won't go, motherfucker won't going nowhere. To get you in. Hey, what, what, your old battery? Yeah. I had uh traded in. Coach, Coach. Coach. Somebody got to take that battery off their bike. So what's up? What's up? Give it to him. Let him put this, his on there. Which I go about 60 miles. I got a jump pack. I got a jump pack, but. It ain't gonna, it ain't gonna run the, the whole bike. Oh. I put shit on top of my battery because I wasn't going on. That bitch is not gonna go with that battery dead, bro. His fucking battery by 10 now. I told hey, y'all. If we jump the stator, that won't do shit. Huh? You jump it off the stator, that, that won't do nothing. The stator now, it's burnt out now. It was kind of working a little bit. It had burnt some prongs on it. That bitch burnt all the way out now. That's, that's, that's our, uh, That's the, that's the, that's the one that we use. That's not 13, that's the one. Right here, right there. That's just a 13. A few moments later. So gotta uh, go ahead and get the work done to the bike, which should have been done yesterday. The other dealer, I forgot what the name of it is, but I'm gonna definitely put him on blast. He said nothing was wrong, everything is okay. Change the battery. Change the battery. We change the battery. Hundred and forty dollar battery. Waste of time and money could have been done, but you ain't on the ground if you're scared to break down. Where's my man Scone? I mean, they all, it's all burnt up. Well, too. you see the right over here by the connector, mm -hmm. how the wires are all exposed? Yeah. Wow. Although this trip didn't go completely as planned, I still had a great time. Even though I missed out on some sightseeing that I really wanted to do, like hit Winwood Arts District and visiting the slave cemetery down in Key West. But I guess that's all a part of the whole ordeal. It's the randomness that added to my memories. And as we took off, we rode into the sunrise. Before you know it, the temperature dropped 35 degrees. So we made a quick pit stop to put our heated gear on and we also had a good surprise as we were able to see some of our brothers 
we had stopped along the way as well. Come here at the okay, same time. Right, exactly. yeah, yeah. So the dealer, although they did a great job, they forgot to plug my plug in for my heated gear. So I had a couple of brothers sit there and uh, fix that up for me. And after a while, we took a picture or two and then we're back on the highway. What the? Like this. Alright, man. Want? So I got a guy here tomorrow that knows sure. power vision. Okay. Um, he can take a look at the bike tomorrow morning. We're gonna try to squeeze that first thing in the morning if we can. We'll meet the Harley of Gainesville. And looks like one of our brothers is gonna have to stay the night and get his bike worked on in the morning when somebody who knows how to work the tuner come in and do it so quick update and, uh, gonna keep pushing long huh Bikes, where you 
going where you come and it's usually older folk and i guess they're really living there you know just having a little bit of nostalgia huh something to eat for the first time some I guess if you want to call it real food there's some stuff The other one hit the hit the horn. One of them hit the side. I thought I the side. I, I heard, but I didn't see a second one. I saw the one. Man, it was on no, one no, 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 no. and the other one. Oh, and hey, look, because the one sitting there put like the hand out the window. And then, what are you telling the phone down? I guess yeah, so. I slow down. I knew he had something. Bro, we, and he got it. He about to stop. It. Yeah, he didn't pull out. No, I was with the thing. I said, that bitch gonna stop me. It's crazy how even though we just stopped, it wouldn't be too long before something else caused our trip back home. You know they say third time's a charm and it's definitely the third time that something has happened. To my left, we got old Young Hog, certified ground pounder. How many miles that was? Nope. Let's see, I got about a little over a thousand from my house to mine. Thousand miles. 
turn and burn. That's ground pound right there. Thousand mile turn and burn. That's how I look on the king of this shit. I'm talking about a real thought. Turn and burn. From Louisiana to Miami. Just to go to just to hang out. Go to sleep. Get up. At five in the morning. And go back home. We would have been back home, but shit. Man, hey, that's alright. I just see Miles make memories. After getting our brother situated, we got back to the highway. We definitely kicked it up a notch to make up for lost time. But really, I wouldn't say even with everything that happened, I wouldn't change a thing. Prepare yourself to the best of your ability, and as always, be safe, be cool, be you, and peace. Oh, and don't forget, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I hope to see you again on my next journey.